Game here with your daily YouTube live streams and more. And, um, okay, I messed up. Uh, a lot of you guys We're may have back. seen. Yeah, a lot of you guys may have seen that uh, I already did a Quarry Part 3 ending. I deleted that, okay? I felt bad. So there was a point in the story where <laughs> Abigail died, okay? I messed up. I, I told Samara to do something on her turn, and it got Abigail killed. But at the end of kind of that last video, which none of you are going to ever see again, um, <laughs> it just didn't feel like our ending because our ending is with Abigail getting bodied. Yeah. So I have the Abigail getting bodied right here, this save right here, and we're going to run it from there. And I'm also not going to listen to anything chat says. I was looking at chat a little bit too much, and I feel like you guys must have Googled the answers or something because... We were just, everybody was getting the live, okay? Everybody was getting the live. So I will show you guys the super good ending if we don't get it. I guess we won't be getting it because <laughs> Abigail's dead. Um, but this is going to be the super secret awesome stream. Oh, this is sponsored by 2K, so big shout out to them. This game has held us. Yeah. We have wanted to play this game so much. This game's got us in a chokehold. In, in a good way. Yeah. A, a, that we want to play it again. So we are running it back. And um, we're going to just base off not looking at chat or anything. And we're going to keep it going. So here we go. Ready? Yeah. All right. Chapter eight. Um, expect some bodies to hit the floor. <sighs> expect some bodies. Okay, I'm Ryan. All right. Bodies to hit the floor. Here we go. Samara and I right beside each other. Yeah, we will. No matter what, we will show the best ending at the end of this. Where is Chris Hadley? Like, I'll, like I'll, I'll, I'll play it on YouTube, okay. yeah. Rude. Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We Should I be ruthless this. this time? What do I, I do? Or... Shut I said no, shut up. I said shut up. <laughs> oh I've done enough God. talking. Okay, so you talk. Say what you gotta say. <laughs> you, Ryan, maybe this is a bit much. I'm just about everything that's happened tonight. <laughs> oh my gosh. All over this poem? You said you heard a woman? He heard it too, right? So, yeah, you did. Yeah. Hold up. You, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? What do you know? Are you in the same room? No, we're in different setups. Honest to heck, a hack, it's Corey. Or should I just say podcast? I mean, we should share information because yeah. we've been hearing things. Yeah. Just reminds me of a local story I know. The hag of Hackett's Corey. A woman in the woods. They say that she died years ago, and now she sort of roams the darkness, waiting for her lost boy. These guys hate it when I talk about it. You've seen her. No, I don't know, but I heard this thing back at the police station, a, a podcast. Azaria Bonafide. Yeah, that's, that's the one it. that you read it on the computer. It looks like Travis was keeping an eye pieces. on it. Why? Maybe it's more than a story. Oh, when you have to find out his birthday, like, log into the BC. All I can tell you oh, is that yeah, whatever's yeah, yeah. happening at Hackett's Quarry this runs deeper dialogue. than you know. She wouldn't have said that if you didn't find that. And take that back from you there. So, come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. I mean, what makes you think I know that? He knows everything uh, about you guys. Are like, he's like they're homies. Friends. They're homies. Yeah. The last yeah. Two months here. He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting. Oh, download the, the game. Link in the description below. It start. is so awesome. And uh, you're going to get a completely different ending than us. There's I think that's so many endings. So tweet us. If you play it, tweet us and let us Dude. know which ending you get. Um, maybe there's another way. Have you thought about not killing him? Have you thought about, you know, not killing him? Uh, I'm thinking about not killing you. That's what? good. <laughs> Look, when the sun comes what? up, I'm stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? What, is, what do they mean they're stuck until the, the next full moon? Don't forget about Nick, dude. Okay, any clothes are going to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. Maybe they have to shoot it in werewolf form. I'm running out mm. of time. 
If I can't find Chris Hackett, now. then a lot more people are going to get hurt. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh... Yeah. I just want to confirm one thing for chat. Yeah. I'm running it again because I replayed the game off stream and let Abby live. But that shouldn't be our true ending. So uh, me and Samara are running it back yeah. with the way it should be. This is the way it should have been. And my bad for trying to make Abby live. I just like getting the best ending of any, everything. But um, yeah, Abby's not alive here. Yeah. So you will not see her in this room. That's probably Abby's blood on him. Oh my God. And we're okay, we're so. gunning it. Yeah. Uh, Chris has nothing to do with it. People are saying it's I'm gonna show you that Chris not has recorded. nothing to do What's with What's up, this? Excuse? What's up, Rick? Mutsa plays Jasper, Zeno, EJ Brady, Bling Bling to Buddy. What's good, bro? Shut up. Fine, do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. Look at the time. Everything's gonna. One twenty-five a.m. That cop car you stole. It's so Where late. It? Ditched in the lake. She ditched Why? the cop car. It was a stolen cop car. You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan. Get somewhere safe. How long do you have? An hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. Easy, get it moving, get it moving. We're, we're, I know this is super late stream, but right. we get, we get the job done around here. Stream? This might be my latest stream. Okay, Laura, this is all you, Samara. Right. All right, kill it. We, we've collected a fair bit of evidence on this walkthrough. Yeah. We have. Yeah. Are you sure this is the right way? Pretty sure. Yeah. Pretty or definitely. What do I look like? A tour guide? Have you Ooh. actually been there before? I mean, n no. Wait, seriously? He knows I so know much, much about everything. Like, all of it. He does, but, like, he clearly doesn't know there. I think it's just because of the, like, the true crime stuff he looks like. How true. well do you know Chris Hackett? Mr. H, pretty well. Like, you're pretty sure we're going the right way? When I first came to camp, I was going through some personal shit, and Mr. H helped me sort it out. Uh, oh, this stream guy. is, uh... You don't know him like I do. 17 plus, by the way. If you're not old enough, don't okay, watch. Okay, okay, jeez. Teacher's pet. Why are you like this? <laughs> <laughs> Look, I don't think anybody knows anybody, not really. Well, I know Mr. H, and, and he never hurt any of us. Well, I know for a fact he's not the good guy you think he is. All he does is try to help people. That's what his whole camp is all about, to help the kids. Yeah, I don't doubt it. You know what I have to do, right? I know. But only if we can't talk to him. If we can't find another way. I wonder if you can save him. Lead the way. Yeah. It's looking like you gotta take him out. There it is. Hack your house. Dun, dun, dun. So he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. I've never been there. But if we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? He just said he's never been there, didn't he? Yeah. Like, That's how does she expect him to know? Question. Full moons are crazy, too. Maybe we just don't. Abby deserves it anyway. She couldn't draw. Oh, my god. That's gosh. what somebody said. That's what somebody said. Look, I understand Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell you. Sure. Yeah. Laura, Chris is a good man. This isn't about good and evil, Ryan. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. 
You got this, Samir. Hey, where are you going? You're on the timer. No where way. are you going? Right onto the freaky no wooden panels. I got you. Careful, it's gonna go. That's a big ball. Are you okay? Laura? <laughs> oh my god. Did you hear that? <laughs> in the same room, yet Samara's radiant. TG looks like he's in a hostage <laughs> situation. <laughs> so oh my god. Bro. Right? The camera's in oh my god. Same, Laura. Yeah. same lighting, same everything. This will be the Jesus. last Marian video Jackson. with my camera, this camera here. I think I'm switching to that one. Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax. Look. Ooh. What big eyes you have, Grandma? He's way too cool with that. Right? No shit. Can you see yellow in my eyes? <laughs> Define yellow? Shit. We haven't got much time. Okay. Time for you to book it. Okay. You got this. Go. Follow the creepy path. Stupid. Ooh, what are, what are those on the ground? Hop, 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 hop. She's like trying to book right? it. Ooh, old mining tools. Do you take one as a weapon? I think she's becoming a weapon. These must have been from the quarry days. No duh. No one's been down here for years. I feel like they have. Right? Bling bling, how are you still awake, bro? How's everyone still awake? Where are you guys from? Let us know in chat. <laughs> yeah. Obviously, this is pre recorded and you're just Samir like it. Samir's my goat. Look at her bangs. Look how cute they look. It's her. Who? My bangs are the keeping hack. me up at 1.30 in the morning. Now this game is so, so captivating it is. Oh, look at everybody. Oh, I don't want to talk during it. Okay, New Zealand, Colorado, New Mexico, Texas, Indiana, India, Mississippi, Sheesh. Saudi Arabia, Colombia, Wyoming. Australia! Oh, shit. <laughs> Imagine those quick time. Right? Quick time. I just died. <laughs> This place is not up to code. I mean, if the code is literally crumbling <laughs> to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Let's just keep moving. Yeah. Oh, it's so funny, Laura. Laura, you're so funny. You're hilarious. Careful. So funny. Oh, people from all around the world, welcome everybody. Come one and come all. Where's your Aussie friend Nick from down under? Well, he just took out Abby. Um, just look at So we're place. one counselor down. No matter what, we'll show you guys the best ending. And then you'll see our ending, and then I'll play the best ending. And that'll be a wrap for the video. Oh, oh you thought you had a quick time? Like, do you think she just like lands and grabs if you mess it up? Because I don't think yeah, she does. Yeah, I don't know. There. I don't know. I could really do with a hamburger right about now. Stop being weird. She's so weird. She kind of looks like she's hitting on him a little bit. Right? Doesn't she? Maybe she's just the werewolf, like. Yeah. She kind of dies. Like the eyes. Wait, you missed it. Abby's dead. Yeah, go watch part two. Abby died twice, actually. Because uh, I tried to stop it from happening, and then she died oh, again. Boy, this is high. Whoa. You look like you're from Terminator or something. I'm walking, and then like the jacket. Yeah, yeah, jacket and everything. Yeah. A long way down. Can you look down at all or no? No. Down. Yeah, That's really pretty though, like the light coming in. Yeah, I like the light. Abby's drawing stuff. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Everybody's hating out. on Abby's drawing. <laughs> Look who's finding their funny bone. 
Will you upload the other stream? Probably not. Just look up the best ending. We literally got the best ending in the other one. So what's your deal then? What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing. It doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp oh, leader vibe. Pick what's in your brain. So I don't fit into the right box. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, pick what's in your brain. Uh, you know that's not what I mean. I've been coming here for years. You get to know a place and it feels like a second home. Oh, he's been coming you know? here for years. I mean, until now. What about your friend, uh, Caitlin? Is that her name? It seems like she looks up to you. Yeah, she she has the hots for me. Oh. oh those two. Caitlin does? Hey, thy name is Ryan. I'm not being smug about it. It's what? Just a fact. They're not exactly secret. What? So what about you? We did you not know that. Like Who do you more? like more? <gasps> I don't know. Maybe neither. Oh. She's like, how about me? They kind of, they're kind of flirting a little bit. This way. I oh, did she light. fall in healing water? When you fall yeah. in water, it like reverses a little bit, doesn't it? Or you can just hang out here. Up I thought to this you. what happened with uh. Super strength. Someone's been eating the spinach. Okay. So, you want to go into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall? Shame you didn't upload the other stream. I heard you got a thirty bomb. Hi. Oh my god. You're watching right here, our true ending. This is our true ending. Ooh, Wheel of Fortune, wheel baby. Of fortune. Welcome to the Wheel of Fortune. She's looking at him like he's a juicy steak. Oh my goodness. That's what I just read. Looks promising. Kind of is, honestly. It's almost four in Texas, but I refuse to miss any of your streams. You're awesome. That's dedication. Kaden, what the flip, bro? You're insane. Mmm, check those old uh, alcohol casks. Yeah. Cask. Careful. Splinters. Thanks. I'm fine. It's crazy how bad my camera looks when we found the party. Right? Alcohol. Wild. And prohibition. So alcohol can go bad. It tastes sandy, I'll apparently. Make that liquor almost 100 and? years old. Apparently. Probably still good. Like it gets good. like sandy? Try vintage. Well, I guess the You can make Ryan kiss like Dylan? That makes sense. I guess when the core shut down, they branched out. Come on. Time travel later. Yeah, explain what happened in the start of the stream. So go just watch the first two minutes if you're confused. You think this is it? Uh beach me i'm pretty much completely lost <sighs> yeah me too shall we Spooky vision. Da, da, da. caitlin Caitlyn liked Ryan too. I didn't know either. I thought it was like, I thought Caitlyn just like didn't like anyone. Right? I thought she was just like on her own. She like, like boss. Oh, I don't need no man. Like boss, uh, boss girl status. Alone. What happened here? Eh, it's complicated. So her and Dylan. Gosh. Both like so it's both these guys. Yeah. So cozy. So we got to kill one of them this off to get Ryan. Really? Yeah, it reminded me of a ski lodge. Sounds. We the battle cool. royale for Ryan. <laughs> You've oh never fantasized gosh. about being trapped on a remote ski resort in a snowstorm? The cable car is broken and you've only got each other for warmth. And when the food runs out, you've only got each other. What the heck? Uh -oh. Weird fantasy. It's cool that all the dialogue is different depending on your choices way before. Right? The ski vacation does sound pretty nice right about now though, huh? You ever been? Like I've Skin. never heard any of it. Don't know the first thing about it. A couple trips down the bunny slope, you'll get the hang of it. Oh, well then, we better get this van up and running then, huh? Okay, we chillin'. Okay. Wait. What? 
Why is the car squeaking? <laughs> is there... Is there something in there? I don't know. I'm getting a smiley face oh ready for God. something. What is it? I... Jacob? Emma? Oh. Are they... Uh. Should I open it up? Your funeral, buddy. We'll have that pop up later okay. for a specific scene. I think getting hit by bear mace wouldn't be fun. I'm so right? sorry. Dylan, I am so, so sorry. Oh, I didn't know it was you. I was really oh. scared and I thought... It's not mace. What? Air freshener. I still would not want to be hit with air I mean, freshener. Air, yeah, it would still burn uh. any of those things. Yeah. It's all I could find in the van. Hey, um... Where's Abby? Oh! Uh, um, I just can't believe Nick would. I can't believe any of this. Oh my yeah, god! I uh, I don't think it was really Nick. She can't be gone. She can't. Yeah, she's gone. Comfort? Yeah. It was quick. She didn't suffer. She's I don't know if that's comforting. What? What's wrong with you? Just fix the car. <laughs> How did this all get so fucked up? Abby got sent yeah. back to the lobby. Yeah. We're gonna get out of here soon. Okay. Can you fix it? <laughs> no. She didn't find this comforting at uh, all. <laughs> not without some parts. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. So you can fix it? Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're going to find it. That sounds like a long shot. Dylan, come on. Good pick. I need you. Good pick. We need we're not going to be mean. It's no. not nice. Fine. It's not in your nature. Okay. No. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. I just want to say that if anybody dies, we did pick up their reboot cards and we'll be yeah. showing the ending where everyone lives at the end. Oh my gosh, yeah. Okay, so we did pick it. We're picking up everybody's reboot cards. Yeah. Remember, this is a game. Yeah. So uh, Abby's dead. Yes, and but some we got other, her reboot card. We got, we got a reboot, reboot card. card. So yeah. we will show you what happens at the end if she survives. And uh, if anyone else falls, then we'll get the reboot card too, yeah. okay? Yeah, let's split up because that worked so well for us last time. There's a shelter under the lodge. You should be safe there for now. All right, all right. Good luck. Oh, she's really, like, she should have gone with them. Right? She's gonna go by herself? Oh, boy. All right. She's so small. Right? She's gotta be like, either he's seven foot and she's four feet, or she's like three feet and he's like six foot. I think she's really small though, because even beside the oh, other me. people, she still looks tiny. All right. Like very, very small. Very small. very small. Abby got boxed up like a fish. Yeah. Oh, that's very, very fitting. Yeah. We like that. Okay, so we're in an old wine cellar prohibition. Like, what was that? Huh? What was that? Oh, it's nothing. We got we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. You think I could time this with swearing? The beep button. Listen to me. You hear that? Oh. <laughs> I could do that. Right? You might have to because the subtitles come up first. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I should do it. <laughs> Look, I am not getting YouTube age restricted. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> Where we came through there. Let's see. Ooh. Empress card. Sometimes it lets you grab it right away. Sometimes it's like yeah. takes a second. There's this. Rum still. Okay. 
we get a good amount of like evidence right yeah that's a creepy picture <laughs> this isn't old still i guess business was booming I guess business was booming. Why you gotta say that stuff? Business was booming. There's a glancing blow. Yeah, I want all the evidence I can find. Oh, another card. The Emperor. Oh, why? Yeah, there's like... Oh. Oh? Oh my, I actually almost missed it. Okay. What happens if you slip there? So this is going to be the area with... I So bad at names. You remember what the guy's name is? The guy who's in the cage? Jacob. How do you remember people's names? Yeah, yeah Andre's really bad. He, like, in real life, too, you're just bad with names. Okay. You're bad with names and you're bad with numbers. Some Jacob. numbers. Jacob looks like he's like messed up. He like, look at the thing. Hey, it's Ryan. He's like, please help. Jesus, what happened to you? <laughs> open cage? No. Oh. Should I open it? No. No, I don't. Hey. No. Bad idea. Why is there? Oh, it's electric. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Can't forget that. Important. Oh, so you gotta be like on it here. with those. Oh, it's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated. Okay, I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. Okay, we're gonna open it up. Laura getting a little suspicious back there. Yeah. Why are you here, Travis? Why are you Why here, Travis? The others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Oh boy. Ma. Uh. <clears throat> it's Kaylee. She's dead. No. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got to screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's Silver dead. bullet. No. God damn it. I'll let that one slide. No. no, no. No, no. Not my granddaughter. Not my only granddaughter. Not my Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. You goddamn piece of shit. Not my little Kaylee. God damn you. One of those what slides. did you do to her? Oh, that's a slide. Okay. That, that wasn't the worst thing she could have said. Right. I think she'll say a lot worse things. Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? Oh. Wait. It's him. Think about it. Why would they lock him in a cage? And who the hell is it? Who the hell is she? She's in charge. She's in charge? <laughs> We've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Your friend? Hey, listen. Okay. They said that they've already got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're, they're not going anywhere. Yeah, that's Nick. Remember, we've got to be they sure. They said they got two of us again. You promised. Fine, fine. You gotta get me out of here. Seriously, man. They took it. They took it. You fucking idiot. Ma. God damn it. <laughs> you fucking piece of shit. <laughs> Get away! Does Get it work or no? Me. Is it working? I don't know. She's so mean to him. <laughs> Someone said that did nothing. Wait, did it not? It doesn't, it doesn't help. <laughs> Wait, it didn't help? It you, oh, you can still hear it? <laughs> oh my god. That's actually so funny. Okay, I gotta help Jacob. <laughs> We're not leaving okay. him in the cage. Okay, okay. Talk me through it. Okay, so all I know is you have to open my door and that door. 
His door, and then the other Definitely door. not that door. Not the oh, third door. cool. Thanks, Detective. Okay, fuck you, man. I'm trying to help. No, oh. fuck you. I'm trying to Shut up. Shut up. The swearing's gonna go through. There's a console. The swearing's gonna go through. Over there, like a box or whatever. You should be able to use those switches to isolate each cage. Okay. Hang tight. Okay. Okay. Three, five. Three, five. No! I said three, five. What? I said three, five. You don't put three five. No, I know. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Because there's no five. So wait. I thought you were accidentally gonna hit four. I could do one, two then. Yeah, I'm gonna do one, two. That's three. And then five. Right? Just hit three first. Three, two? Yeah, do three, two, and then one, three. Or one, two. It shouldn't matter which order. Are you sure? So three, two. Then that's gonna get five open first. Hit three, two. All right, five open. Hey, dude, nice. All right, now don't fuck it up. Yeah, this would be really bad if we open the other one. Yeah. Continue. Why would you abandon it? Like, oh no. Couldn't you focus, just do three dude, again? Focus. You have to do two switches. Uh, so it's one, it's one, so two. So it has to be one, two, yeah. I could do two, one if I want to get of interest. You got it. There you go. Hey. You are released. I feel like they should just have like the numbers and just have one switch. Instead of this like combination math. Yeah. Oh, damn. The hillbillies you look wouldn't awful. have been able to get that. Thanks. Um, no. Where's everyone else? No. Um, Jake. Emma wasn't with them. I don't know where she is. But you should go catch up with them. Tell them about Abby. You should tell them about Abby. We came in through the mines. I don't, I don't know if there's a way back up. Why wouldn't he come with us? Right? Like, what's he going to do by himself? Like, with no clothes. OK. Aww. I'm going to give you this keyboard and mouse. Wait, um, it's Laura? It, yeah, I think it's going to be Laura. God, and not my only granddaughter. I got to get my smiley face ready. Not my Kaylee. Not my little kid. Okay, here, I can mute it like this. Tell me if this works better, chat, for muting her swearing. What? So you, you had those slurs in your goddamn jail for two whole months, right? And you are telling me now. <laughs> you think that helped? That instead. I might have missed I'm one word. A bullet into each one She's of their little so sorry mean. shit stained brains. You you gave them your silver bullet gun and they shot my Kaylee with it. Is that what you're telling me now, Travis? No more blood on your hands. That's what you you, you said it. Oh my God, we are way past that now. Oh, Ma, what what if it had been me or 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 Bobby? What then? She was your family. A good boy protects his family. Kind of mean lady. You ain't no good so boy. Mean. I wish I could take it all back. I wish I could take it all back, but I can't. Well, I just don't, I, I don't understand why you, you, you couldn't have just taken care of the problem when you had the chance. Taking care of the problem? Do you hear yourself? Yes, I hear my goddamn self. I may be old, but I ain't deaf. I'm a police officer. No, oh, so now I'm blind, you. Got it. I nailed that one. Now I'm blind. Oh, you just flashing that badge around like it's worth a million dollars. The only reason you got it is because Hank got killed in a gypsy fire. Ma. Don't ma. Don't ma me. Would you sit down, please? Don't you tell me what to do. Please. And don't you go around. Don't you go around like you better than everybody else, because you ain't. Would you please sit down? Don't you tell me what to do, you. Piece of shit. So aggressive. Yes. Grandma, what are you doing? I feel like it's dangerous playing a game with quick times at uh, 2 a.m. It is. Oh, right, she's right. jacked. Ma? So is she like part Sit werewolf? Is she part werewolf? Werewolf? She's pulling her up just by her hair, right? and she's like 80. Maybe she's just a strong old lady. She's a jacked old lady. She just built 
different. Creepy angles. Good job. We don't want to hear bad words while people are being torn apart. <laughs> <laughs> You're on fire, bro. You're on fire. Uh... She's not a werewolf. She's just strong then. Yeah, she's like insanely jacked. Me, the strongest old lady we've ever seen. Right? Oh. Welcome back. Did you miss me? No. Hopefully, we don't miss you at all. We don't miss you. And we don't like you. Cards. Let's have a look, shall we? You're scary. The Empress. Look at her. <laughs> Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> but it's no less than she deserves. Take out the mom. Okay. Thank you very much. The wheel of fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle-eyed can tell where it's going to stop. The Emperor. Someone said, Granny, please take your vitamins. <laughs> <laughs> Authority, paternity, strictures designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall. And their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. Rot. Details. All right, which one do, do we want to see? One? Which one do we want to see? Then which choose you the see? possible future you you'd like to witness. Why don't, you Why don't we randomize? Carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. See the Empress. Empress? Yeah. Alright, let's see. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well. <laughs> Go. You still got time. Be <laughs> careful now. Be um... very careful. Right. I feel like it just ain't gonna be good for the grandma. Yeah, I feel like just she's yeah. The it ain't, it ain't gonna be good for the grandma, yeah. let me tell you that. Oh, Dylan. Dylan Dilski. Big D. Big D, baby. Hey, yo, they call me Big D up in this E. Oh, whoa. Chapter 9, Is I'm like, yet? oh, nah. there's 10 chapters in this, bro. In so, Big D. So, Big D. Need some guns, what bro? What if we just, like, walk to the main road? This isn't the main road. No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. <laughs> so basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we here? hit the nearest whatever? Yeah. Oh what was God. that? Let's just keep moving. Okay. Yo, Big D is back. So... He's gonna hit you in the back. I guess this is me now. With his stub of the what? hand. You're gonna look great what? with the hook. We can call you Hooky McHook Face. That's good. Depressed. Oh. No one will treat me the same. I guess it's must he be positive. Like a, he's like a positive dude. Yeah, he's yeah. like a positive. He's like a unique. Hack. Yeah, he's like really happy. Good luck. He get got different attachments for it. <laughs> yeah, man. Lean into it. One hell of a story, too. Yeah, I guess it's something okay to be to sad about sometimes, on the radio station. Yeah. We're all going to be laughing about this in a few years. You, me, maybe even Ryan. I think we missed our shots. Kind of got close at the fire pit back there. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? There's always next year, right? Is it a love triangle? Well, I don't know. I'm getting some... 
<laughs> I'm getting some interesting vibes from this. Wouldn't really matter anyway. It looks like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident. <gasps> Heroic. With an eye patch. It's Wait, so Ryan does like her. Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> oh, so Ryan likes Laura. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. We, we would have never known. No. All right. So we're at the scrapyard here. Oh, shit. Relax. It's Motion detected. Did they kiss? We're okay. I think. Oh, look, Werewolves Steve killing all these counselors. Hey, come on, this way. AKA just Abby and. Guys, how do I make them kiss? Like, Laura's kiss. a little weird around, him, but like Laura has a boyfriend. Okay, Max is annoying. You are Laura now. I am me? ready. I am ready right now. Me? Okay, guys, I I know. You uh, like him. Easy, Ma. Mm. Put me down, you wretch! Blow your fucking head off. It's very literal. Oh yeah. Um. Everybody, just relax. Because I don't want YouTube shoot, to delete you this see, video off the internet. I need to cover a part of the screen in a second here. Get ready. All right. I'm ready. Gotcha. Yeah, you got you got me. You, you got me, lady. Let's see if you got this. Get the fuck off of me. Uh, just a happy go lucky ah! guy. Just a happy go lucky guy. Just a happy. Oh! A lucky guy, just a happy, happy Everybody guy. Just so happy. I'm just gonna keep this what up the for fuck now. Is going on up here? Oh my gosh. Uh, oh, oh wait, 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 go. we're good. Y'all don't need to see this. Wait, you can see his face. Yeah, his face. Just don't pan back to her, please. Look. Oh. She's gone. Little Bobby. Mom's gone. Please don't pan back to her. I think we're good? Yeah. Are we good? I think so. Oh! oh! <laughs> no more pressure. Okay, we're good. We're good now. No more protecting anyone. We're not going to collect a Travis. reboot card. got sent back to the lobby and we didn't pick up a reboot card she'll have to play the next game yeah we didn't get around to it um you know what's great is you guys could download this game by clicking the link in the description below and you can choose not to struggle with a gun there and maybe the grandma lives maybe laura gets bodied there anything's right? possible anything literally. is possible literally anything's possible Fuck. okay so ryan has been stabbed Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Ah, 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 okay. All right, that's not good. That's a, that's a deep stab. Yeah. Do not. I'm not gonna yeah, pull the knife. Pull if we know anything, if you get stabbed, you know yeah. I'm not a doctor. Yeah, I'm not doing that. But you're not supposed to pull out the knife. No. Oh, oh, oh. You're supposed to like apply pressure and then yeah. bandage it all that. You're supposed to bandage it in. Like, really? Like, if you got stuck, I would like put bandage like around stuck? it. Like, if you got stuck. If I got stuck? I think you're supposed to like bandage whatever is in like in place almost. Like, yeah. Kind of like bandage it like, just, like stuck in place and then obviously go to the hospital. But... Yeah, we got a little letter here. Oh, a little pin. No, a little, what is that? Amulet? Um, what you call it? I don't know what it's called. I know what it's called because I have. Locket. Locket. Ooh, what does this say? Let's read Kaylee's letter. Wait. Mm -hmm. Oh, letter, letter of confession, confession. addressed to her grandma. He's like, you are kind of mean. Like, I want to read it. Right. Can I pause it and read it? You think? I, don't know. I can't read yeah, that. Really? Wait, can you see a reflection? Oh my gosh, I'm a vampire. 
I'm a freaking vampire. There's like a crow's nest here. Okay, we got cabinets. Looking like a good place to hide, right? Yeah. This dude's, the knife is still just in him. Let's see if this door is unlocked. It is not. <clears throat> He's looking through the peephole. Is that what it's called? Yeah. We see a path to another. <sighs> okay, so the door is locked right now. There's nowhere to go. We have the bed here. And we have a bucket. Everybody has a... What is that? I think it's either a sausage or a, or a werewolf poop. I don't know. Everybody has a bucket like that besides their bed, right? They can poop in. It's normal. Yeah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> what the heck, guys? What is that? Why? Why? Oh my gosh, is that the grandma? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Rip. Why does she look so creepy? <laughs> Everything reminds me of her. How much is this game? Click the link in the description below. Oh, uh -oh. big guy's coming. Big dumb is coming. Here's Johnny. Where am I gonna? Shut block door. Yeah, I'm gonna hide. Fine. Uh, I mean, I would not go under with that thing. No, I would no. go in the cabinet. I don't like understand like under the bed because if you're right beside it, sure you can't see, but from like far away you can like see under the especially that bed's like so high up. Yeah. It's not a good hiding spot. No, it's not. If you ever play hide and go seek as a kid, don't go under the bed. You always get yeah. caught by going under the yeah, bed. Yeah, you do. Because it's so obvious. It is. It's so obvious. Okay, we gotta hold our breath. It's a long breath meter here. So we just gotta hold on. Don't stop believing. Okay, so he unlocks the door. That's good. And he looks under the bed because everybody looks under the bed. Even Big Dumb looks under the bed. Hi. And that is our time to go. Not Big Dumb. I, I don't think his hearing is very good. No. This dude is just the goat and not making a noise, I think. This dude's the goat of like not seeing people that are right in front of him. Yeah, this house is massively scary. I'm close. Stand by. Over. Guys, can we get hearts in chat for Big Dumb? Oh, Big Dumb's chasing us. Big Dumb walks a snail's pace though. Right? Look how slow he is. He's in no rush. He's in no rush at all. He doesn't care. He's like, I may or may not catch him. You can't hide from me in my own house, fucker. That's not nice. You're a fucker. I, <laughs> I like that. I love that response. <laughs> that has to be my favorite response. <laughs> All right, Laura. No. L to the A to the U to the R A. <sighs> Laura. Are they going to show the mom again or am I good? No. I'm good. I think so. Just don't pan to the mom again, please. I mean, we're not even in that room anymore. YouTube's going to so... hit me with the 18 plus if we get the, yeah, the mom with half her face, yeah. you know? Um, run. Like, is anybody even chasing me? Oh. Oh. Damn. Ooh. Ooh. You're just dipping. Right? And I ran. Ran so far away. Oh, you're just bolting it. I don't even know where. How does she know, like, what's what? Why'd she go back inside the house, also? I. I see it was a good thing you're in. Where the heck am I? Oh, investigate the grand piano. Oh, you. 
No, you're not going to play it. I That's kind of hilarious I if you start playing it. I feel like that would be a really bad idea. No, I'm not going to play it. They're going to know where I am instantly. <laughs> Hello? That'd actually be way too funny if you played it. I play it. Just everybody comes. I die right away. I wonder what it would happen. That's a fair hit cue. I want to see what this is. Can you hit this or no? You think they'd cover up bullet wounds and signs of injury? Perhaps they serve as a reminder that these animals are definitely deadly. Oh, interesting. Hmm. So you're not going to play the piano? I feel like playing the piano is a bad idea. This house is so creepy. Like, I feel like now is not... Like, when you're running for your life, like, maybe that's not the time to play the piano. There's other times. Oh, no. Oh, great. Oh, you can explore a little bit here. Okay. Okay, nothing there. Think you're good. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Is that some... These cages should hold Chris, Caleb, and <gasps> Kaylee. When Cam's over and keep hunting White Wolf, he's got to come back sooner or later. Be safe for blood. I feel like... That's... You can like, look around more. That's like a huge hint. Right? Hackett family tree. Oh. Sure. Hackett family has been around for quite a while. Their roots Ooh. running deep in the local area. I I was always kind of like, it'd be kind of cool if I had a family tree, like someone well, kept a record. And Caleb, right? I know. Born in 1995. Wow. Caleb's the same age as me. Wow. Perfect. 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 There. Got one room to go. The red room. Red rum. Red rum. The sun. Dun, da, da, da. Seems to be a perfect room for a battle. Okay. Oh. oh, look at look out the window, just nice little view. <gasps> what? Oh, is somebody standing there? Yeah, it's the ghost lady. Wait, really? Can you look again? She might not be there anymore. Look down to the right. Okay, that's oh, creepy. I seen that. That's so creepy. All right. Uh, uh, Old man, chill. What are you doing? This guy's so annoying. He really is. Like we get it. We 200 pumped your wife, but we ain't playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. <laughs> You know something? I ain't got enough silver to kill you. I forgot she was a werewolf for a second. I was like, the what? Uh... Ooh. I feel like no matter what, you can't die here. You're a werewolf. Right? Get him right in the groin. Like, even if he stabs me, like, I feel like I'm fine. You're so strong, too. Right? <laughs> Such an advantage. The werewolf's not like light. I kill him. I don't know, he wants you dead. I don't like him. I like him and the, the old lady. The old lady, like, they're just not nice. Oh, wow, she's way too strong. Yeah. We gotta I mean, keep up our. He wanted our to kill Katie. you and make you suffer. Yeah. So I feel like, um. Yeah. We gotta keep the keep KD up too. Like, we can't. The KD up? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Apparently, people are saying that she's becoming more of a werewolf. She's more sensitive to light. That's why it looks brighter for her. Oh. See, if we didn't let Ryan out. Ryan? 
No. Nick. Nick. If we didn't let Nick out there, he would have died. Hey! The cop kind of looks like he can't see you here, doesn't right? he? Right. He's like, are you kidding? You killed him too. <laughs> Travis, he didn't look that devastated. I mean, they were mean to him. I mean, his mom was at least. Oh, I mean, now, I guess it's still, looks yeah, it's still. Oh, Jacob. No, Jacob was the other one in there. That was Nick. Wait! Oh, I'm saying Jake. Jacob would have died if we left him in the cage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dip. Cops having a rough night. Yeah. All right. Back to the big Ryan. Okay. You got to be really nice to Laura. Wait, we want Laura and Big D. No, sorry, we want Ryan and Big D. No, I think like Ryan likes Laura the best. <laughs> okay. I mean, that's what he said, Dylan said. I don't know if he's telling the truth. This would be a horrible situation to be in, like a house you don't know, just like this house too, just like right? the wallpapers like destroyed. I know. There's like these old, this big dumb dude <laughs> chasing right? you with blood all over him. He stabbed you. You're trying For to hide no in reason. walls. Like he didn't even do anything. You're hiding in walls like a rat. <laughs> Playing limbo over here. They hung out all together for like five minutes. <laughs> it's true. Okay. Oh, hold my breath. I hate when they make the bar so long. I know I have to hold it for like ever. He's like, I like sometimes listening to the walls. This dude's just staring into nothing, bro. Look at his face. I know, he looks like he's got sun in his eyes, but it's just like, <laughs> it's just the last brain cell. Oh my God. Just the last brain cell squeezing to the surface. <laughs> This place looks interesting. Oh. Yo, come on, man. You gotta help me. I do? Yeah, I promise. I won't tell anyone anything. No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. He's big dumb. Yeah. Should I stab him? I stab big dumb. He stabbed you, stab I stab you stab me, I stab you, big dumb. Right? A stab for a stab. <laughs> Ow! You stabbed me! Yeah, fucking hurts, don't you? <laughs> I ain't never been stabbed before. I feel kind of bad when he talks like that. I know. Oh, it really hurts. He, like, Dad. doesn't seem mean, too. Like, he seems like... I don't know if he's fully developed. Yeah. He's like those horror movies where, like, the, yeah. the big guy's, you like, not smart. You can like, yeah. <sighs> Hey, 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 it's me, it's me. What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, Ryan. Oh, how bad is it? I'm so sorry. That's not bad, huh? You gotta say it like that. Right? I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First, Max, how are you? Someone in chat said, can you react to Abigail death part one on YouTube? We, we experienced that. Yeah, we experienced Abigail's that. Abigail's dead, okay? Yeah. She, her head got punched off. Yeah, watch the part two. It watch was part two, there. yeah. Get ready, you have to select it. Oh. Sympathetic oh, I thought it was called. a timed one. Sorry. Sympathetic. Sympathetic. It's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. I shouldn't have let you come. Uh, you're not the boss of me. <laughs> <laughs> How are they flirting? One's a werewolf, one's about to die. Like, what? Am I dying? Yep. 
He's lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? Wait. Great idea. Maybe it, maybe Great it idea. will. What? Bite him. Bite him. Now. Ryan, if you let me bite you. What? If oh, you you'd want to do that, huh, Laura? You, it means you'll be infected, which means. Which means it will heal. Yeah. But it also means. Yeah, yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yeah. Would you do it? Yeah, because it takes a while, and like they should be able to clean right, things up yeah. by then. Time. And I worst case, it, like it's you just fighting lock yourself to get in out. a cage every full moon. If you let me bite you, worst case, you that's pretty bad. Worst case, then then I, I mean, it's better than Chris. dead. It's it's not killing Chris. It's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life, and mine, and Max's, and your friends too. It's Chris or him. Let you bite me, and live to kill Chris Hackett, or bleed out and die. It's sad for Chris, but pretty much. Ryan's a kid, like. It's your call for now. So are we doing this or no? <laughs> I see looking at her. Accept or decline, accept. where's Kiss? Accept. Oh my where's gosh. Kiss? I will accept your werewolf bite. Do it. <laughs> Do it. Smash will pass. Oh my gosh. Nice and tender for you. Pass. This isn't a romantic scene. I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> they it do like be. each other. It could be. You should be sniffing that. Let me, see. Let me just see what she's. Oh, away? no, you don't pull away. Don't pull away. Don't pull oh, away. Gosh. Don't pull away. I panic every time I see that red line now. <laughs> what are you doing? He's having a little too fun okay, with it. Okay, okay. Right? He's like, okay, you ate a little bit there. That was... She's like, did we just have a moment? He should start to feel better soon, I guess. Worked for you, you got a whole eye back. Right? Fuck. We gotta go. What? Uh, How fast does it work once you get bit? It's like, homie's like straight up leaking right now. He's leaking. But she was bit a while ago, too. She hasn't heard yet. She was bit, she was like, bit a like, full, like, when like, she went day back ago. to the island to see Max. I mean, it's still the same night because it's the full moon night. It just feels really long, you know? So, like, must have been a few hours ago. Yeah, so it's probably a few hours. Like, a couple hours. All right, yo, everybody in chat, give it up for the one and only Big D, baby. Yeah. Big D, come around. He's going to smash these cars up because they're in a junkyard. Out, huh? So... Do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped apart. It's just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. She's like, she's a smart car girl. All right, I'm leaving. It doesn't let me, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh, I don't want to be here anymore. Imagine it like would let you leave. Right? Like, I am dipping. Okay. Looking for intact vehicles. Now, I didn't know this before yesterday, but you see how I'm walking? You can sprint kind of by holding shift. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm looking. Ryan's in detective. Really? Oh, he is. I remember now. 
He's a detective, isn't he? Sure. Who is Ryan in Detective Pikachu, guys? The only one I remember in Detective Pikachu is Ryan Reynolds. Wait, she was scratched a month prior because Max changed back and she took him to the island as a human. I don't know if that's the time. No, I, I think the, the scratch is different than the bite. I think he scratched her and then changed back. These sons back. of bitches had it all planned out. And then the island was more recent. The messed up part is that they know. do know about the full moon and they don't get everybody out like a couple of days before. They I wait know. for the night. That's completely irresponsible. Yeah. Completely. Ryan is in the Detective Pikachu. He's the son of Pikachu. Wait, Pikachu has how, a son? who's T? How does mm. Pikachu have a son? <laughs> how Looks does... like these guys are cooking the books a little. Oh yeah, we saw him in Jurassic Gotcha. World. You said it. How does Pikachu have a son? Wait, hold up. I want to see what that clue was. Was that a clue? Scrapyard note. The scrawled request to keep something off the books is a little dodgy to say the least. There must be something here that they don't want anyone to know about. Keep this off the books. SUV body damage. That's probably the SUV that um, oh, Laura okay. and yeah, Max driving. drove in. Yeah. Okay, obviously it wants me to hit this big button over here, but let me just check this garage out. We can hit it from both sides. Let's go. Okay, moving around. I need more evidence. There's nothing here. Okay. <laughs> We're just doing loops. Loop to loop. I like how they let you hit this button from both sides. Right. Open the big gate. Okay. <sighs> Are we going to end up in a documentary? No. Shut up, come on, let's go. What would you do if this was you, like, in real life? I would leave, like, I, or I would go on a boat and I would just float in the middle of the lake in the morning. Because you kind of know that they can't deal with water. Yeah, like, I would take that little paddle boat that they were in, I would go to the middle of the lake, and I would float there until morning. Just full dip? I mean, they can't get you in the water. You're not wrong. Bring some snacks. I bring a blanket. I just. What is this back here? Oh. This is way too creepy. You think Brian's okay? He knows what he's doing. Probably safer than we are out here. Come on. Samara is very intelligent. Okay. They've got some loud shoes. Just kicking things. Oh my god. I, I honestly, I trust her. She's just booking it by herself. Okay. You think there's anything else I can investigate here for like that clue thing? Or do we head up to the giant crane? Where does that bin go? There's a lot of these, look. Seems a little dangerous. Wait, why did the light turn off? I'm right here. I'm booking it right now. You don't even know. <laughs> it's just like a maze. I, right? Should I check down here or no? You jump off. Or should I just go to the giant yellow crane? What do you think? Oh. Oh, there you go. That's why. I was wondering like why it's making you explore yeah. that much. Oh, there's like a trash compactor back here. 
Have you guys ever been to a have you ever been to a scrap garden? You don't know. Yeah, I don't think I've ever been either. Okay, it looks like there's nothing here. So we're gonna go to the crane now. There's no way this is a dead end. Are you freaking kidding me? I have to walk all the way back. Samara's tired, let her sleep. We're almost done. This should be done really soon. I, I, I can't leave now, you know? She's too far in. I'm too far in it. We just gotta... You gotta power through. Gotta power through. I'm trying not to fail quick times. Yes, do not fail quick times. It's 2.30 in the morning here too, by the way. Ooh, look at this. That's a nice truck. That's a Bentley truck, guys. Okay, we're going up. Look. Real late night stream. Mm-hmm. The car have the lights on? What's up with that? Right? It's so much fun to see you both. I love this setup. We're, we're going to be doing a, a joint channel so, together. You ever operated a crane before? Soon. I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. No, nope, uh-uh. Nope, oh, I hear that now. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? Can I have the gun? No. Just watch my back. She, she has two. He has, no I, offense. I you, sure. You have yeah. one sure last hand. hand. Um. Just uh, watch my hand. back. Yeah. 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 I mean, can you even shoot a shotgun with one hand? It would be so heavy. It would be, and like, you'd be like, and the, the recoil would be. Oh yeah. Insane. Is it called recoil or like blowback or? I remember Samara and I shot like a 50 cal sniper in Arizona once. All I had right. a bruise on my arm for like so long. Looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to I clean up after themselves. <laughs> Put a lost your elbow. Okay, let's right. see what we're working with. All right, not too complicated. Turn it on, flick the switches. Welcome back, grabber. Now you oh. My bad. That's good. Oh, totally nobody's gonna come right. attack you now. All right. Here goes nothing. I feel like this would be pretty hard to operate one of these things. And this is like heavy machinery. You have to be careful. Like these things always look easier to operate than they probably are. Yeah. You can take at least like a couple weeks to like get it down, I think. You don't mess up, you don't need me a couple days. I mean that one's easy. About time. <laughs> well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing running. <gasps> Score. Oh. Oh. I think he does a pretty good job in this, like his acting. Right? I gotta warn her. Like right? he looks visibly worried. I gotta warn her. Yeah. Shit. Shit. Um. Uh, Just lifting the car with her, like, outside it, like she might not even grab it or something. There's, some, there's something coming! What? Hide! <gasps> oh, yeah. Ooh. Huh? Oh. Down, boy! Oh, fuck. Homie's really. Dylan, get the damn werewolf off the damn car! How do you want him to do this? Uh, oh, fuck. Hurry the fuck up! <laughs> Slam car, she's dead. They should just. He's really sensitive to sound. Yeah, they should carry she, around like just really She jumped like this is Fortnite. Ah! You don't take all right? damage yeah, on them. Oh my gosh. Homie's upset. This dude has a portable fire torch. A blow torch. What happens if you fail here? Oh my gosh. Burn, baby, burn. Hey. 
Oh boy. I feel like fire's not. It won't take him out. Wow, that thing is terrifying. He looks really good. This one looks like scary. Big D, you got this, bro. Come on, help me. We need that big D energy, baby. Oh shoot. I'm very curious what happens if you fail those. Line it up. Smush it. Smash a pass. Pretty close to Smash. Her. And now they can get the car part, right? It's right there. The hood's right there. Okay. I mean, the thing isn't dead. The only way it can die is through silver. Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life. For realsies. Yeah, you know, no sweat. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? To play me in the movie about... How brave I am. Don't push it. Okay. So, so much for our brilliant escape plan. I don't get that. Okay, back to the lodge. Are you nuts? Better than being out in the open. Come on. You think if they've been like, the werewolves for so long yeah but like they'd have more silver bullets and like yeah guns with like everything bullets. would just like, be what straight if up all their guns have like silver bullets you would think so that would be wise okay yeah emma emma who doesn't have her friend abigail emma's all alone remember we will be showing you the ending with everyone surviving so first our ending your first night after then, camp at a luxury yeah. spot em <laughs> So she's just alone because Abigail's dead. Well, nothing's getting through those doors, so why don't I feel safe? Okay. Um don't love that it's like so dark out. Mm, that's where Max oh, got. Good dad. Oh my gosh. This is the one where you didn't help Max. Yup. That's where Max got clawed. Yep. Almost to death. Uh-huh. So trying to cover up what happened here. You are correct. So all those... Oh, there you go. Get all fun. Like all those choices end up mattering. That's why there's like over a hundred different endings. Someone said almost 200 endings. Well, it's so cool that even like, not even like including the endings, it's like those choices, like, and even stuff that you see, like it Go changes the dialogue. It's thing. You seeing this? The main fuse is gone. Wait, so who took out the main fuse? Because remember when the power went out? Silver shells. Well, when they were in his office, the power went out. Somebody pulled out the main the fuse. Missing fuse. Those fucking hunters are everywhere. Oh, I guess the hunters pulled it out. She looks messed up. Yes, yeah, she does. She looks like she's been crying. Huh. Terrifying. I was like, we out of here. We out of here. Hello, little trap door. Right? She really Where likes using her phone. Go. I, I went too with the light. Trap doors in this place, not gonna lie. Okay. She's booking it. Last trap door she went through, almost got her killed. This trapdoor is going to lead into Chris Hackett's office. Oh. Well, that's when we loosened it earlier in the mm -hmm. game. 
It made it sound like it was going to be such a big deal right? that we loosened that thing. But in the end, it was just like one little yeah, misstep. Yeah, it's just like more of a hassle to get up now. Emma's been through a lot. Yeah, she has. She kind of low-key killed Abigail, though. <laughs> okay, I, she didn't, but... I mean... If she didn't do the kiss thing, they wouldn't have run off into the forest, which True. means that Nick would never have gotten bit because they wouldn't have been there. True. And then Nick wouldn't have, yeah. yeah. So I guess like in a roundabout way, yeah. Mm -hmm. Chat, do you think we're gonna let anyone else die? Yes or no? Do you? I don't know. Oh, they ain't getting through her in a hurry. I've learned my lesson though with Ryan. Rest a bit. I am blasting any beast. You'll feel better soon. Cool. Like if you don't I'm blast them, they kill you. Yeah. Good, actually. If you have a chance to shoot them. What are you doing? Yeah. Stop it. She looks messed Do up. Do you smell that? No. Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Or just a way out, maybe. I'm done being chased and stabbed. He's like the main character, sure. Mike. Right. Him and Laura. Another way out. Fine. I know. I like them both. Uh. Can I talk to him? Just, just look down the room. Uh, oh. walk to the left. See if you can like. Oh. I guess Watch not. Your step. Yep. He's like, I'm not. Oh, careful. Let's see if you can just explore back there. Oh, you can. Oh, <gasps> you sickos. Huh. What's that? Proof we're on the right track. Stay close. Yeah, all the better to see you with, my dear. Shh. <laughs> He's so dumb. I feel like they'd make a cute couple, though. How about the left there? Look at that orange chair. Wowie. Oh my gosh. Did you see that pony? Look at that pony right there. Oh, I didn't even know. I didn't know that was a pony. I thought it was like a chair. We're just ignoring the beast in okay, the middle let's, of the room. Okay, let's acknowledge what's happening here. Um, yeah. What was that? Either we have great vision or they have bad vision. Right? Yeah, that's... That's definitely Chris. Like, we knew they'd put him somewhere I safe. I found Chris Hackett. Son of a bitch. Well, we need to kill Chris Hackett for both of them to live here. Everybody loves Chris. Right. Oh, great. Okay. So I'm shooting Chris. You have to, okay. otherwise okay. we're dead. He is, Chris is currently eating his brother right now. What are the odds that we fall onto the floor right. with them? Uh, oh boy. Double werewolf extravaganza. Yo, help yeah. your brother out, homie. Right? Oh. Wow, that's a lot. Wow, she really rocks him, huh? <laughs> Silver back mirror. Bobby! Uh, the gun! Oh. Uh, oh. Bobby's, Bobby's dead either way. And I'm dead next if I don't blast this dude. Poor Bobby, honestly. Why doesn't he bite some people? Like, he bites some people and eats right? some other people. Hey, Chris Hackett. Have fun in the afterworld. Bow! Oh, that was a clean shot. Thanks. That was a good one. That was a good one. Thanks. Uh, Laura is currently... Okay.
He was gonna kill her with that. Funny he didn't use it yet, though. What was he waiting for? Was that the hand that was getting bit? No. But he could have just still stabbed her. Mm -hmm. I hit that 200 pump with the spaz. All right. Back to Laura. 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 <clears throat> I was going to cough, but I don't want to irritate Thanks. my lungs. For um, not killing me. Yeah. Wait, so does she remember? Like, oh, no, she just sees. So, what now? Everyone's back to normal? Oh. You think this is over? This isn't over. He says it so ominously. Uh, right? I don't understand. Chris is dead. Oh. Oh, Chris wasn't the first. Mm -hmm. See, that's the problem. That's not possible. Caleb. Kaylee. The girl you killed? Her brother. Someone said that Travis would kill Laura there if you chose to shoot him at the jail cell instead of syringe him. Really? Mm. So you would have stabbed and killed Laura there. Oh my gosh. And the reason we syringed him was because we thought, remember the tarot card? And we just thought that like those were the best ones. So yes. We were doing all of them. So we're like, we're like, we have to syringe him. But in that case, it actually was the best one. Yeah, it was. I mean, I feel like shooting would be over. I don't think you kill him there. You, like, maim him. Yeah. But also, you, if you didn't find the syringe, then you wouldn't be able to use it. Yeah. Because you could just go back what? to that right away. Yeah. <sighs> Build your own story. Caleb bit Chris and Kaylee. Chris was just trying to protect him. He was a good man, my brother. Well, then who bit Caleb? Silas. Been tracking him for years. He's a, a gypsy, a transient. He'd been long gone from the area, but we hoped he'd come back so we could end this. Anyway, there's sightings up and down the coast. A feral albino child, giant white wolf. Giant white wolf. White wolf. What? What'd you say? Where? Where'd you see it? Hey, let him go! At the, at the cabins earlier tonight. Like he saw it? Like, we never okay. saw a white... I don't remember seeing a white wolf. Okay, okay it makes sense. It all makes sense. Uh, he must have been back for months, and he's what ran you off the road two months ago. It's way too fitting. Help me. Oh, because they had everyone caged up. Help me. That's why... That's the only thing that can run him we over. We can still save Caleb. Oh, true. We can still save what's left of my family. We, we can help those who are still alive. That's why he was so, like, interested. Why the hell should I trust you? I'm not asking you to trust me. I'm telling you we can end this. We kill Silas, everyone gets better. Everyone, uh, who's still alive anyway. His whole family got taken down, like. Right. Okay, okay. So, where would we even find him? I know exactly where to find him. Okay, let's go. He's like right. very not shaken up for this his. This doesn't like... mean I forgive you for what you did to me. I understand. So he did some messed up things, but I feel like he did it because he felt like Can he had to. Please get me some fucking clothes. But he's like very okay for like his whole family just being killed right i mean his mom wasn't very nice but no had but like both chance. of his brothers you had your chance to wipe out that wretched family and you failed sorry it is a lot doesn't matter there's still time we can still come out on top we? past is the past let's just <clears throat> look to the future shall we The sun, the vitality of a new day. 
There's still time to wake up to the warmth of a night survived. Your choices, your actions, your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness and see the sun rise once again. Ooh, this is a cool one. Judgment. The bells of judgment cry bloody murder. Or do they? The fury of a hatred earned, a fate deserved. Likely, but he may have his uses, though he won't forgive. He won't forget. What are you talking about? The Hierophant. Where did you find this? Where did you find it? This shouldn't be here. He's been through enough pain. No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what they did to us? A little flashback. The six years ago. No. Oh. Oh. What have they done? What have they done? Oh! Well, how they incorporated her into like storyline. Fireworks about to be in. Oh. I think there's a uh, something you could do that makes her right. Good life. So she has a son who is a dog boy, aka a werewolf. Sounds nicer when you call it a dog boy. Oh, you're just a little dog boy. He's a little dog boy. It looks like he's been like gashed, doesn't it? That's not her son, unless her son's the sheriff. Shouldn't be like, shouldn't she be like happy because her son's alive? Okay. Oh yeah, it's go time. That time of the month. Thick full moon. I can see how that sounded weird. Mommy's coming, Silas. <laughs> Mommy's coming, Silas! <laughs> I said like a full moon. Bro, you guys are so weird. Why does the tower pop right? up like that? Like, I wanna know. No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what they did to us? How they hurt us. He's out there still. All alone, each full moon, they hunt him, armed with 
it's silver. He's eating people, lady. Right? Put an end to a curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid children. Little Silas. My little white wolf. You must be protected. You must not follow this path. Do you understand? Remember how I've helped you all this time? You have not helped us. Not very much. Remember how much I've done for you? You've done nothing. Truly. You've confused us. Yeah, pretty much. And by accident, it helped us do one thing. Yes, the syringe thing by did accident. help. But, like, that wasn't her helping. It was just... It's Max. Are you guys ready for the thing. Max attack? A thingy thing. Well, let's see how Max is feeling. Chapter 10, last chapter, guys. And then we have an epilogue and we'll go through all the endings. Oh, man. Oh. What, the, what the fuck? He's Where in a tree. Of a fucking tree. Laura! He's vibing on that tree. How much does he remember? How the hell am I gonna get down? Oh. Oh. Asked an answer. Uh. <sighs> well, that's a good uh, question. Oh Samara, can you hear me? The real question of how did Silas become a werewolf? And how in six years was Caleb the only one he bit? That, that is a great question. And we do not know the answer. Oh, yeah. He should go hide somewhere. Yeah, he needs to chill. Everybody else is vibing, you know? Where the hell are my clothes? You gotta be kidding me. He's got a lot of blood on his face. How did Chris Hatchet turn to Warwolf? His kid bit him. Okay. How do you clean off all this blood? Know. What? This dude cleaned off all this blood. He looking like, mm. He looking like, you know what I'm saying? He looking like, hey, yo, you know? <laughs> you slapped my daddy's ankle, bro. Totally should have just gone to the Harbinger Motel. All right. Let's keep her going here. He's wearing his girlfriend's clothes. Yeah, I mean, he's looking... He's looking pretty tight in it. I'm not going to lie, right? Yeah, you're looking pretty cute. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> this was on a crash collision course for me. Yeah, so like, how did the white wolf... Yeah, that doesn't... Right? Like, how did he become a werewolf and then... He only bit Caleb all yeah, of that time? like everybody else was like Chris This is a unique or... hat, by the way. She That's super come. weird. Why don't you have any hats like this? I didn't know that that was a thing. There's a ponytail hat with a little... Like a gash in the back for your ponytail. We're just a pretty girl, aren't we? He mad cute with that outfit. Homie, you, you've been through enough. Right? Oh my gosh, look at him. Like the outfit and all, bro, you've been through enough. I think we stay. Yeah, just stay. Just, bro, just leave just it. Just stay there, Max. Don't worry. Just... Ryan's looking after Laura. You're good. You're you're solid. You're you're fine. You're fine there. Alright, it's Caitlin. You don't need to move. Big moves coming up for you. Woo! 
Last chapter, baby. All right. Ready, ladies and gentlemen. He's a Barbie girl, someone type. He's a Barbie girl. Okay. Well, can't get much worse than it already is, right? Great. Just like the cartoons. It's been off and on all night. Gives us a little time. How do you figure? They don't like water, remember? Right. Ooh. Right. Oh my gosh, if it just rains oh, on a full moon, then they're good? Swimming in the lake all night. Uh, and die of hypothermia? No. No, you go in a boat. All right, well, we're good now. <laughs> Night's not over yet. These fuckers know we're in here, and they're coming back the first chance they get. Great news. Okay. All right. We gotta get a vantage point. Come on. Yeah, it's Brenda's song. Yeah. That's Caitlin. Did you know that? I didn't know that. Brenda song, 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 song. Oh. Right. Wait, is that like a burning deer to your left? Keep going, like by this tree. What in God's green earth is it's that? It's a beautiful stag. Oh, you gotta go up the oh, other no stairs. Oh, you can. Hmm. This would be way too creepy. I don't know if I could handle it. Right? Yo, he's kind of kind of messing your vibe. Right? Like, come on. Come on, Mike. Come on, Mike. What is that painting there? Is that bruh? No, that's just some random oh, huge yeah. head family. Brands and family. Oh. Dog tag. Doug. Doug the nice bulldog. To to Doug face. the bulldog. So what, you're like bulldog. Mr. H's brother, I guess? Who? Cares. <laughs> Ass. When you and Ryan went to the radio hut. He's dead. Mr. The big dude's H's dead. Brother, I guess? Right, right. Mm. We toss that back on the ground, huh? Right. There's like a little box on the ground. Did you see that? No. Oh, there's something to the right, though. And it's a note. It says, I have a clutch on you. Jeez. I'm see really struggling if they're begging for a dollar. Q. You said it at like the end of the queue. I know. I'm sorry. I was just curious. Uh, look at that beautiful, beautiful painting. Can we look at it? How long has this guy been here? Hidden Q. Wait, what's his name? Wait, where was it? I don't know. Oh. Large and overbearing, the regal oil Septimus painting. Septimus of... Hackett? Wow. Uh, oh Say no God. goes back. Septimus. I like that name. A long time ago. Long enough ago that it was okay to have an oil painting made of yourself. I kind of want an oil painting of me. I also want to point out how irresponsible that they had a summer camp running while full moons did happen, even if they had cages. Yeah, that's right. Hacky family not responsible. Like, why are you of all people running a summer camp? Like, you're a family of werewolves. Like, maybe just don't do the summer camp and like go live somewhere secluded, like away from everybody. And then, like two days before and two days after, keep them in a cage. Right? Oh no! Wait. 
What'd you hit? I messed up. I hit prepare for attack. Oh, what did you want to do? Look around? Yeah. I think Every we're dead. Every all through the summer. Huh? What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. stronger. We're here to lead the way. Are you? What meets for life, we're proud to say. Shout at Strat and shout out loud. Focus up. Focus I'm up. so tired. It's focus 3 a.m. Focus up. Focus up. Two months and you, you only have a few months. more quick time events. Here, you do it. You no, do no, it. no, no. You do it. You do it. You do it. <laughs> you do it. You do it. No, I believe in you. I believe in you. You do it. I'm going to mess something up. This is your story. So you, won't, you won't mess up. You're good. Put your finger on the keys. There you go. Mara, if we die in the game, it's on you, someone said. Yeah, I do. Showtime, motherfuckers. Oh, there you go. How he like never got clothes. Like he's just been walking around. This dude around has been that. running around Fuck this horse. <laughs> he's like this was not worth it. We didn't I I even kiss. I'm sorry. Right? More than anything. <laughs> well, you can tell him that when you're alive. Yeah. Fuck. I just wanted one more night together. Is that too much to ask for? I kind of screwed it all up. Shh. Oh, Stop crying, you big baby. I mean, he didn't mean for it to happen. I feel bad for him, but... I don't know what to do. All right. He cry. He's sad. He's sad, so he cry. He's sad. All right, back to you, Samara. Okay, you do this quick. You got this. Okay, Emma, just nope. stay cool. Emma's here to help you out. Okay. Just hopefully, breathe. Abby's not here. <laughs> what the shit? That's George looking for snacks. Right? That's like George if he like smells the tree. Breaking down the door. I I don't know how you'd react in real life. That is terrifying. Is it coming up the stairs? Like, hi. Oh my gosh. Why would you wait? I don't know why you would wait. Like, I don't know on what planet you would wait. Let's go, let's go. Like, why would you wait? Wait for what? It makes you interested. Like, what was right? wait? Like, maybe wait for him to, I don't know. <laughs> Try and talk it out. Dylan just ran. He just dipped. Oh, Caitlin, no. No, no, no. I, I can't help you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, uh oh. I think it might be. He can jump out the window, honestly. I don't know. Wait. <gasps> yes, I can. Silver shells. Oh, that trick. Oh, my God. Come on, Caitlin. Come this way. This way. <sighs> Talking to a TV. Yeah, I feel like if you go through a window, it's going to make noise and stuff. I mean, this is also very risky, but... Well, also, if we go out the window, we're not getting the silver bullets. Yeah. Uh, we're gone. All right, focus up, focus up. Okay, we'll it's only four up. buttons. Don't press anything yet. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh, the way it's following you is so creepy. Stop! Oh my gosh, he got a little close there. He's like, LeBron James, and then he jumps. Where's Abigail? 
watch part two. <laughs> the ending of part two. Run! I think if you keep running, this will be the best way to find her. Caitlin, this way! Like, you need to find Emma for the yeah. silver bullets, or else if you shoot them... Yeah, like, we don't have anything that's going to do anything right now. It will actually kill them. Homie's like, he's not thinking straight. I mean, he's got one, he's got one arm. He's lost a lot of blood. It's hey. Hey, hey. Okay. Let's go. She's a good shot too, so. Yeah, she is. You can't miss this though. Did she load it in? Oh. Why was he showing his butt off right? to you like that? Okay, okay, okay. okay Alright, don't miss, don't miss. Oh my god, I thought you missed. Oh my god, I thought you missed. Did you thought you missed for a second? No, I was trying to scope in, but you can't. You tried to scope in? Yeah. Where you tried to scope in? Yeah. <laughs> but it wouldn't let me. <laughs> you tried to scope in? The thing's vibrating on the ground. Honestly, these werewolves are too much. I hope that was Fuck Ryan. You. No, that's not Ryan. Motherfucker. I mean, there's 66% chance it wasn't the Australian guy. Nick, you're Nick. so bad with the names. <laughs> oh. I love how he comes up with the pan. What is that gonna you do? You got it? Yeah. I mean, bro, he yeah, has one it. arm. You gotta like, I know, I sorry, know. Sorry, one hand. Like, he can't shoot. Like, I guess it's better than nothing. I can't believe you tried to, like, quick scope him or something. That's still tripping me out. You tried to quick scope. I tried. I you tried. tried to quick scope a werewolf. I tried. I did. All right. It's the last major scene. Gosh. And then we'll Wait, play. Do you wanna the... do it? Do you wanna do it? No, no, you got this. You got this. This is your decision. Hey, you got this. I got you. It's like five more minutes. You got this. Okay. Can't mess up. Okay. Just believe in yourself. Choose what you would pick. So what exactly happened six years ago? She looks different there. There was a fire that wiped out dozens of people, and now there's werewolves and a ghost that roams the woods looking for her lost baby boy. Which I've just put together is Silas. Oh shit. It's a long story. No, it's not. <laughs> there was a fire. Silas the wolf boy escaped, bit a bunch of your family. You failed to stop him. Burn. I feel bad for Silas, honestly. What happened in the past doesn't matter yeah, right now. But how did he turn to werewolf? Uh, I know. It kind of does, actually. We need to know what we're up against, at least. What we're up against is a feral boy turned werewolf for the last six years has avoided being found. No matter what we did. Every full moon we were out there looking. Every single one. Now the son of a bitch is finally here. So what we're up against is my only chance to end this thing for good. Fair enough. So how do you even know where he is? How the hell are we going to find him just driving down the middle of the road? They hit it on the nose a little bit there. Right? How are we going to know where he is? Oh, don't be concussed. Oh, he hit his head on the wheel. Oh. Ryan's taking a nap back there. What would you pick? I got the gun. This is a quick little pass out. He's on the roof. I can't reach the gun. Forget that. Just get in. Take cover. I feel like if somebody yells, get down, you have to listen. What happens if you fail here? You don't play right? Oh my god. 
Omi's been hiding for six years and he randomly just pops out onto your car. Go! He oh. loves cars. What has he been doing for the other <sighs> days in the month where there's no full moon? Where did he go? Living by himself in the forest? <laughs> just disappeared. When he's a normal person? Yeah. He's gotta be near He's a roaming gypsy, so. Kinda bad for him. Let's look around. Are you crazy? He's not a kid anymore, right? Is Ryan good? Yo, Ryan. Ryan's having a rough time. Ryan's been stabbed. Right? He was a werewolf, no longer a werewolf. You're okay. Been better, but yeah. Over here. Got some blood. Got some blood. Yo, bro Donnie, thank you for the two and thank you for the kind words, Please man. There. What's up? And Nami plays shout to you as well. What the hell happened back That's here? Whoa. This is where we went off the road two months ago. The exact same spot. You're trying to decide if you should shoot me in the head right now. <laughs> what the? Go ahead. That's what you want. so to random. Stuff. What the what? heck, bro? I like low key feel bad for him. Right? Doesn't even give you a choice because that's messed up. Normally, I'd have werewolf's blood cover our scent, but I'm all out, so we're high risk. We could be killed. You ready to end this? Let's go. Let's fucking do this. She looks beat up. Go team. Guys. Only kind of brave. Right? Why? She, she has a flashlight on her shotgun. Interesting. God damn, this place has got some uncool vibes. Podcast didn't do it justice. You don't know the half of it. This is where I saw her. Her? Nobody's protected right now. I thought she was, blood. I thought Max hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? The woman. The old woman. She was saying something over and over again. Oh my god, she was saying Silas. No, that's impossible. Who you're talking about? I saw her too. In the run tunnels. It's Eliza Voris. Silas's mother. I think. You think? Who was she? Card lady. She ran a traveling sideshow called Harem Scarum. Came here six years back. She kept her son in a cage. Kind of like, like no, the super wolf messed boy. up. Right? Died in a fire. Some say she never left. The hag of Hackett's quarry. We've been looking for Silas ever since. How did the fire start? Well. Really? You're still hiding stuff now? You blew half the head off my niece, Kaylee Hackett. One of the kindest, gentlest souls to ever walk this earth. And all she wanted to do was help that little boy. Locked in a cage by that freak show witch. Uh, yeah, that is. What did she do? She just wanted to help him. So how old Travis. was she? I don't know. She convinced Caleb to start a fire. It's just a jury, right? It's maybe. I mean, I don't know when this is, but he was born in 1995. Yeah. Give him enough time to get Silas out of his cage and give him his freedom. 21. It was six happened. years ago before. No. Yeah. 
He's 20. So he that minutes everybody was dead. Never see Hayburn, Liza, whole crew. Kaylee managed to get Silas to freedom. But Caleb got bit in the process. That's why you've been hunting him. Silas, I mean. Every full moon for six fucking years. I feel like that's a bad way to freeze him. Some hunter you are. What else? What else? other way? Light everything on fire? I don't know. Oh, you're saying, oh, to free Silas. Yeah. I thought you were saying free Caleb What's and that? stuff from the curse. No. This is all that's left. Jesus like, Christ. Like, they killed everybody. Man. Yeah. Yeah, not a good Inside? idea. Don't light things on fire, no. people. Negative. Damn, I never saw any of this. I didn't even know this was here. Samara, preparing for the ending here. Why does he walk off by himself? Why? No. Oh, that's so creepy. Ryan? I don't like that. Shit. I'm sorry, that was... Close. We must be close. Did you both see, see it too? I kind of wish I hadn't. Same. What is it? Silas the dog boy. That must be it. Careful. Oh, great. No? I don't know why they call him the White Wolf. It looks pretty red to me. Fucking Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Just resting? Well, I guess he built that. A little nest? When he's like human. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. What's wrong? Do what you gotta do, Samira. What are you waiting for? Do what your heart desires. I do feel bad. Shoot, you stupid girl! Blast that fool. Release him from his curse. Please, let's just, let's just go before we, we have to see him like that in human form. It's too late for that. Yep. Oh. I want to see him in human form. Gotta get my smiley face ready. Dang. I wish they gave more backstory on that, like... How did he get turned into a werewolf? Right? I don't think he was, like, you can't be born that way, right? This lady's gonna be so mad. I bet you think you have it all figured out. I bet you think you're fucking clever. I tried to help you. I tried to warn you. I even started to like you. Not now, not after this. I will not forget what you made them do to my Silas. You're messed I've been up, with lady. You all night, and I'm not about to stop now just because the night's come to an end. No. Whenever you hear a noise in the dark, a whisper from the shadows, the breath on the back of your neck, that's gonna be me. I'll be there. Now I will never leave you. Wow. Can't tell I alt F4. 
Oh my gosh. Someone said their theory is the witch cursed him and used him in a freak show for money. Mm, you probably did him a favor. Huh? I was definitely doing him a favor. I mean... Oh, I know. I mean, and what... you save everybody else's life too. Well, it's not even like he had any life for the other days out of the month. Like he was just living by himself in the forest. I yeah. guess. Yeah. It was not good comms. This this game is insane. So now we're gonna see a review of everybody and their status, um, and then after that, we're gonna show you guys what people are calling the best ending too. Um, so you guys can see Max having survived the night. Max was cured. The werewolf curse when Ryan shot Chris Hackett with a silver Let's shell. Let's go, Max! Oh my gosh. Bobby Hackett oh deceased. Gosh. Bobby was mauled to death by his werewolf brother. Poor Bobby. Poor Bobby. Oh, oh. Chris Hackett deceased. Chris was killed with his favorite counselor. Ryan shot him with silver. Unfortunate. Oh. Laura shot Constantine, Constance's face off in a struggle for the gun. Jedediah Hackett was choked to death by a vengeful Laura. I wonder if you can keep him alive. Laura like did some damage. Kaylee, Chris Hackett's daughter, Kaylee, was shot and killed by Laura and mistook her for a werewolf, Chris. Mm. Abigail met her demise when Nick tore her head from her body. All right. Yep. Yep. Having successfully avoided infection, Jacob was freed from Hackett's basement and survived the night. Nick survived the night when Laura killed Silas. Nick's werewolf curse was lifted. Oh, so he was bit by Silas. Emma survived the night in the safety of Chris Hackett's surveillance room. So he was bit by Silas. So Silas was attacking people. Dylan survived the night by taking refuge from Caleb in the kitchen. <laughs> Caitlin survived the night by killing Caleb, curing all those infected by his lineage. Let's go, Caitlin. Oh. Abigail was able to pass silver shells to Caitlin during the attack in the lodge, which Caitlin used to kill Caleb. Wait, wasn't that Emma? Travis survived the encounter with Silas and finally saw an end to the curse that haunted his family for six years. Ryan was cured of the werewolf infection when he shot Chris and managed to survive the showdown with the white wolf. Laura killed Silas with a silver shell, curing every infected person who survived the night. Oh, there's Silas. Laura killed Silas, the dog boy in his nest. The curse of the Hackett's quarry is broken. Let's go. There we go. They would play some actual like copyright music, but um, yeah, not going to get banned off youtube for that you absolutely love Sophia. so we did pretty good we got everyone alive except for abigail yeah yeah it's okay her drawings weren't even good yeah her drawings um, weren't even good and like you gotta you gotta kill a bodies girl. recovered in Can't summer camp yeah. murder mystery oh look what do you make that Anton? bodies recovered Bad in summer journalism. camp mystery. murder mystery isn't that just an unsolved murder so, yes, I, I suppose that is what most journalists Oh my gosh, wait, say, so did we have enough the journalists evidence? Yeah. Of North Kill. Let's go! So this title and stuff will change depending on how much yeah, evidence you collected. Much competition in North Kill, probably now, here's good. the thing. This podcast is like 20 minutes long, yeah, so we're not going to listen to it. But it depends on how much evidence you collect, I believe. We definitely got a lot. Yeah, I mean, we got a bloated corpse, an attack photo, torn bags, empty vial, memory card. Kaylee's letter. That's pretty good. Yeah, we got like, more than half, 60%. Yeah, I feel like that's pretty good. So um, that's our story there. Um, and you love to see it. You really, you really do. do. Now we'll show you guys the um, the that's all crazy. good ending, if you will. Okay, can we at least start the podcast before oh, you completely I just want to hear one line yourself to cynicism? I thought we'd done the whole Hackett's Quarry thing. Not this Hackett's quarry thing. What was this like three months ago? Oh Old gosh, news, dude. Anton, introductions Sorry. first. We are bizarre. Okay, yet I'm not I'm not listening to it, but you can you can listen to it on YouTube or something. The best thing is if you download the game yourself and try it out. It's totally worth it. Um, let me just go ahead and let me do what the quarry best ending. Perfect ending epilogue. Oh my gosh, literally everyone They're alive. Off. Okay, so apparently this is the way... I don't think you can get everyone alive, but like maybe they pieced it together, I don't know. Hundreds of different endings oh. you can explore in the game. Talking. The Quarry. This is the extended epilogue of what I believe is the true perfect ending. Oh. In order to achieve this, we save perfect ending. 
In order to achieve this, we here? save as many counselors as we can, all of them, and nearly oh, gosh, all of the Hackett family. You may disagree, but I do believe that Travis in this game does have some noble intention and is trying to save his family. A key feature here, though, this is by video games, every piece of history and every clue evidence you're entitled all to a special ending within the epilogue where the counselors are all exonerated. They don't go to jail. The Hackett's remain oh. in business and life kind of they remain in business on. this is not the complete ending i'll show you how to do that to to on a different podcast video but this is just the epilogue what? and the extended scene afterwards podcast, get, like, the backstory and stuff. do you want to listen to it i mean you can play it okay wait i just want to see what happened in this guys okay so in this guy's playthrough okay we'll play the podcast a little bit in this guy's playthrough Okay, so Max survived. Okay, this is where it gets interesting. This dude's game is like lagging or something. Oh, uninjured, Bobby was able to fend off an attack from Chris, his brother, in werewolf form. How? Oh, if you don't stab him, maybe. Oh, maybe. Thanks to Bobby fending off werewolf Chris, Jed survived the attack at the Hackett house. Constance was protected when her son Bobby fought off her werewolf son Chris. What the heck? They played it completely Jeez. different. Chris is killed by his favorite counselor. Okay. That has to happen. Kaylee dies no matter what. Okay, he avoided infection. I think I could actually just skip like this, right? Uh, and then Abigail survives. Made the safety of Chris Hackett's surveillance room. So she'll actually be with Emma. Uh, taking refuge in the kitchen. Oh, Caleb Hack. What? You can survive. Oh, my God. Oh, Caitlin Ka alive. Survived the full moon thanks to her werewolf infection, which was cured when Laura killed Silas. Caleb, Caleb Hackett returned to his human form permanently when Silas was killed. Wow. Huh. How did this guy get this ending? That's so interesting. That's so cool. You could have so many different right? endings. Okay, Travis Hackett survived. I think this is the best one, probably. Yeah. Ryan survived too. Okay, Silas absolutely he has body. To die, yeah. And then does this guy explain it? Psycho teams charged over summer camp murder. What do you make of that? Oh, he just plays out the whole thing. Of me. Okay, we can we can let's listen to the podcast, yeah. Okay. Um, Unified, the podcast of the paranormal. You're I'm not gonna Grace, listen to it, and I'm Anton. And together, I, I feel like we explore the possibility of supernatural involvement in real life, okay, everyday yeah. occurrences. Yeah, and that's exactly what they are: it's real life, everyday occurrences. So I'm gonna go to sleep. Of um, but I'm gonna listen to this tomorrow. Natural occurrences. Mm -hmm. No. Oh, you can let Caleb bite her instead of shooting. Okay, so I Caleb hope you've got hat insurance, Anton, um, because I'm about to blow your end. mind. Did you just ask if I had hat insurance? Yeah. Caitlin? Yeah, Caitlin. Instead of shooting, you just let him bite you. That's the problem, though, with this game. You don't know if he's going to kill you. Yeah, you until Because last happens. time we did that, he... <laughs> He tore Abigail's head off. To yes. Ensure those things which mean the most to you. A hat. All right, you can do yes. it. Okay, I know where your priorities lie. Go on. Anyway. There's actually there a better, like, a credit screen than you think. Coming back Wait, actually, really quick. Why don't you say, why don't you say we're going to listen to the rest of the chat, but Samara's going to dip, but why don't you say bye, everybody? Thank you for coming on the walkthrough, Samara. And if you guys enjoy this two-camera setup, Samara and I are doing a dual channel together i'm not going to tell you guys what the content is yet but it should happen within the next month or so i know a lot of you guys have been waiting but this has given us the motivation because this looks so awesome it is very cool i like this. and this is probably going to be the last stream you see me using this camera i will be on this camera next time i wow. think that my setup looks so cool on yours it does it looks so nice this one looks like even the walls look nice though. right like the wall color like but your, it looks like that in real life your like, walls I, are like Ray. Well, look at that over there. Like, it looks like that in real life. Yeah. It is nice. Yeah. So, uh, we're going to listen to the podcast because Samara's a sweepy girl. Sweepy. And how did you like the ending? I liked it. We did good. I liked it. You don't rip Abigail, but um, we saw the other ending. Abigail. 
Abigail's like, if you blink, you miss her. Oh my god! You know, it's not like a Ryan going down. Or like, yeah, she wasn't my favorite. So. She wasn't my favorite either. That's our story, though. Like, that's our story, right? Like, we built it. That's what it came down to. And it's interesting how things change with little little kind of Even changes. Even the dialogue Even the changes. dialogue changes, yeah. Like, with making little changes. So, okay, and let's listen to it. I'll talk to you, chat. And I've sourced some information. I remain skeptical, but I'm all ears. Under my hat. Under my hat. I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, God, why? Why are you smiling? Stop it, I hate it. Why? I had braces. I have to make use of them sometimes. You do have very pretty teeth. Thank you. That's something that a lot of podcast listeners might not know about me. Okay, <clears throat> good to know. So, it just so happens I've got someone on the inside. So, <gasps> today's episode on the inside. is going to have a bit of a show-and-tell vibe to it. Who do you know on the inside? The inside of where? What? You know someone on the inside? Don't we all have someone on the inside? You know, an inner critic that says, stop doing a podcast, no one's listening. You should listen to that voice, Grace. Okay, well, what I really meant is, let's call it an anonymous donation. You've seen so many versions, it's really cool to see all the little ripples for real, right? That's wild. Oh, hit that like button if you're enjoying the stream, by the way, and don't forget, you guys can pick up the game yourself. I'm very curious, send me a, um, send me a kind of, summary of how your game went uh after you click the link in the description below download the quarry for yourself and yeah okay should i go on this camera now oh my gosh Samir has to go here the whole time all right yo may i just rock this camera right now chat was good bro chat was good You know, we're not the only ones who flagged this as a bizarre situation. Oh. Someone actually reached out to us. They sent us a package. Did you? You didn't open it. Anyone who, I don't trust anyone who listens to this show. Oh, I couldn't wait to open it. Surprise! What the heck? Anonymous donation. Okay, you've always promised me since day one of this podcast that if you could see true evidence, you will consider all options, right? Did you not say that? I did say that, yes. I mean, I know you... Knowing for a fact that we would never see any evidence, I did say that. Okay, well, we've been sent information, and we need to decide whether it's bizarre or bona fide. Ooh, bizarre okay, or bona fide. Let's do this. For anyone listening at home, we are about to open a package from a mysterious person who listens to this show. 186 endings? Holy. Us, whatever it is, congrats, you got us. Sorry, the tape is just really... Really, there's just so much tape on the package. Sorry, can you help me with this? Do you have like a key I could like slice at it with? No, I don't want you to dull my key. Just use your fingers. But just give me your fucking key, Anton. Oh no. my give gosh. Give me the fucking key. No, get your own key. Not like you lock your door. Of course I lock my door. What are you What are you hiding? What am I hiding? Do you not lock your doors? No, I have nothing to hide. You think that ghosts are real, but you don't lock your doors? What no, the heck? ghosts couldn't open my doors. They could walk through my walls, Anton. Okay, you need to be more concerned with murderers. Take a look. Apparently, they found another body. Oh, look, it shows it. You can't just show me a picture of a dead body. You got to tell me before you're going to do that. Okay, then let's take this over. Anton, can I show you a picture of a dead body? No! I can't work with that, Anton. Okay, So it goes fine. through all the yes. evidence that you got. It's, it's a dead body. Okay, what, what is this? What am I looking at? It's one of the hikers that went missing. Do you remember that? Yes, that's the true part of the story. Yeah. Ed Benson was his name. He was drowned in the lake. Oh, that's okay. one of the hikers. Drowned or was drowned? Now you're getting grammatical. I'm not getting grammatical. If you drown, you just went swimming and you drowned. If some, if he's been drowned, then someone drowned him. Well, then I think I implied precisely what I meant to imply. Now, of course, I can't verify this info. Of but course you can't. What, do I have like a history of not verifying Yes, info? it's fake. Okay, but I feel very strongly that he was drowned. Okay, well, do the police know about this? Are the Hackett family suspects? Okay, okay. I mm -hmm. like that you are getting into this. So you don't get to see all the evidence like up close. So this is kind of cool because we got the video, like the SD card from one of the cameras. So we'll get to see what's on it finally. Here's the thing. 
The newspaper says this guy's still missing, right? He looks pretty fucking found in this picture. Okay, yeah, I mean, he's not missing, he's right there, but yeah. why? Why would they say he's still missing? Because it is a conspiracy, a cover-up. Don't you see? They're all in on it. I, I, who is all in on it? The Hackett family? The Hackett family, the North Kill Gazette. I told you I've been suspicious of them from the start. Okay, uh, okay, so there's the one hiker, he's dead. What about the other one? Ann Radcliffe? Still missing. Who knows how many bodies Ooh. are still down there, though? Who knows how many bodies are still down there? I don't know. This is pretty inconclusive. I, I'm sorry that the guy drowned, but this kind of seems like a big to-do over nothing. Or is it a big undo of something, which is what a cover-up is? Okay. You, you love the podcast? Yeah. My words like that. Okay, so I anticipated your skepticism, which is why I saved this. I'm curious what evidence she's going to pull out next. next. Finally, you're going to present me with some ghost ectoplasm. Put out your ring finger. I've got a little gem to slide onto it. What do you got? Leaked photos from the hiker's camera. Photos Ooh. that show them at Hackett's Quarry. So maybe they were there and then they dropped their camera. It happens all the time. Yeah, they dropped their camera whilst being murdered. And their bags were found there, too. Oh, oh no way. Do you have a fake photo of them, too? Oh, please. Okay, so you have a picture of bags. These could be anyone's bags. Well, they match up to the ones in their photos from their camera, and they have a monogram of their initials. I think, at least. Or it's one. Yeah, this is kind of interesting. Tell. Yeah, okay. That's not nothing. I'll give you that. So, we've got to talk a little more about the Hackett family. Right, so these guys are like the heritage landowners, No, right? you can't zoom in on the photo. Yep. Their great-great-great-grandparents were trappers who claimed the land way back when. They just claimed it? Yes, they did. They put kind their Kind of messed up you could do that. Just like the well, man I guess you can't really... Like, the Hackett you know. family flag, right. Well, apparently when they claimed it, they found... Quartzite. Quartzite? Okay, I was hoping you would ask. Fun fact, every building in the whole of New York is made of quartzite. Is that true? That's not fun or a fact. Most of them are, but I digest. Digress? It was a pun. They dug the quarry and hit great heights of success before Septimus Hackett classic bad guy name, the seventh son of the trappers, the number seven, has great supernatural powers uh -huh. what the heck that's my fair mind. number chill okay so then they only had the land to live off yes you say only but this land actually spans acres that's a lot of forest oh my gosh a lot open of mind unexplored stuff. darkness Ooh, okay a great place to hide to have all these dark secrets for seven the acres is huge reclusive family mm -hmm. and this is where we start to get a little more into paranormal territory okay here acres we go acres and acres of haunted woods if you say so i think we have enough evidence Wait, was that it? That's not it, right? Oh. The <laughs> uh, heck? Welcome to Bizarre Yet Bonafide, the podcast of the paranormal. Welcome back to Bizarre Yet Bonafide. Anton, today I'm actually going to pass you some light rating. Okay, you're gonna make me read this. Mm -hmm. All right, um, this is. Oh. What you're seeing now is a copy of a letter that Kaylee Hackett wrote to her grandma, allegedly. Mm. <sighs> All right, uh, this seems like more of a you job, but I suppose. Right, I can but read I, I this. feel like if some of the evidence comes from your mouth, it will have more clout. <laughs> Not more right. clout. Okay, here we go. Gammy. How long are we gonna drag this shit out? Mm. I know family is the most important thing, but I wanna know what's outside the forest, outside this damn house and camp, and I sure as hell know that ain't about to happen cause of who we are. Maybe we can explain what's going on. Fucking show people. Then they'll know we got no control over it. 
I know you're just trying to protect us, but one day you won't be here no more. And right now it feels like we stuck in a dark hole. Mm. I can't sleep, Gammy. Or if I do, I dream about that fucking fire. We were just dumbass kids back then. I wish it never happened. Ooh. Love, K, X, O, X, O. That took a turn. Yes. Dream about that fucking fire. Does that not read as the haunted scribblings of someone who saw something that they shouldn't have seen? Yeah, no, I'm fully creeped out. That's she creepy. She's clearly going through some stuff. And this is legit? I mean, I don't know why someone would fake it. Then again, I can't verify any of this. So you've got to suspend your disbelief slightly. Man, yeah, that convinced them. Girl. Yeah, there was something going on, something eating away at her. And that's what I want to explore. Okay, well, consider my disbelief suspended for now. Next, we have Ooh, this okay. empty vial thing. Okay, the way you say empty vial makes me think that there was something creepy in there before. Well, it's not half full, you little optimist, okay? We've got a photo from whoever my supernatural fairy mm. godmother may be, but what are your initial thoughts? Your godmother sends you vials full of... This, I mean, it looks like there could have been blood in here. My fairy godmother, not my actual godmother. She's estranged. What the My heck? god, what did she do? It's actually what I did. But the important <laughs> thing is, look at this vial and tell me it does not scream nefarious ritual. Yeah, I mean, it seems like it could have had blood in it. Yeah, something about this doesn't It's look werewolf like blood, actually. Normal. Yeah, well, it's a vial full of fucking blood. Okay, but putting the Hackett family aside for a moment, there's more to this. Are you ready for some real spooky shit? I'm ready for real spooky shit. I don't know if you can provide it, but please try. <sighs> don't get too freaked out. I'll try my hardest. Okay. It's the photo, right? Hand? No. It's the photo of okay. the werewolf. Do you need someone to comfortingly pat your back? Please just... Say what you're gonna say. Do you want me to turn all the lights on so you don't- I don't want you scared? to do anything. I want you to say what you have. Okay. Oh, so there's a photo. What are we looking at now? A photo taken by one of the counselors, Emma Mountebank, downloaded from her phone. Oh my God. Is that real? This is what we're here to discuss. <laughs> it looks shocked. I mean, doesn't it? I don't think so. Look at the eyes and tell me that's not real danger. What the hell is that? Bizarre, yet bona fide. Bro, that, that's happened. More than what we're being told. Man. There's something else, too. Yeah? Look what happens when I put it through a negative filter. Who? What is that? It's her. The hag of Hackett's quarry. See? Full circle. I mean, that could be anything, dude. It, it barely even looks like a person. Oh, what's that thing where your mind makes you see faces and shit? I can't believe you're still questioning this. What do you want me to say? Ultimately, unless I experience something myself, the most likely reasoning is that it's fabricated. So, what we've got here, this could incriminate the Hackett family, or what's left of them, at least. Wait, you believe it? I, I don't know. At the very least, we should tell someone Ooh. that we should know, right? <sighs> Do you believe it? All of it? No, I, not the supernatural stuff. I'm talking about killing those hikers. We've got a body, evidence they were there. This is real stuff, Grace. It's stacking up against the Hackett's. We might, yeah. we might actually we got, know something. We got a whole flapjack stack of evidence. Yes. So what do we do? Shut off the podcast and report <laughs> this to somebody? What? No. <laughs> Anton, we finally have something going here. It's getting juicy. Yes, we have something real. We have actual people have actually died. This is actually crazy. Grace, you did it. So did Just I get the good ending then? Take the win. Let's turn this off and actually report it. No, say actually more ass. Hiker remains recovered. Hackett family suspected. Surviving member of the Hackett family has been arrested and charged with the murder of missing hikers Edward Benson and Ann Radcliffe. Oh, shoot. <laughs> um, so that means the, the cop got charged with murder? Hmm. Hmm. Huh. Uh, you know, I mean, I guess, uh, I guess it is what it is. <laughs> oh, no.
<laughs> Bruh. We gotta go watch the good ending, see what it says at the end. Who would have who would have known it? The podcast in the best ending video is different. Okay, we'll we'll check it out. Wow, and he did all that? He didn't I mean it looks like the werewolves killed the people, so. Well, at least he didn't die this time. He was just being charged for murder. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess. We'll watch the all evidence ending. Let's do that. Is this it for the podcast? Okay, let, let's go watch uh, an ending where somebody finds it all. Uh, the quarry. All evidence ending. All live, all evidence. The truth can't be contained within. If you downloaded photos from my phone, yes, they would all be shopped as well. There would be a filter on it to make my eyes look big and cheeks look pink. But I don't even think that has even any of those filters. Look at the eyes and tell me that's not real danger. Yeah, it's weird. Yeah, weird, bizarre. Yet bona fide. What the hell happened? More than we are being told. Yeah. There's something else too. Okay. Ooh, see? Look at what happens when I put it through oh. a negative filter. No, no, no. That could be anything. It makes your just shows up at breakfast, but I, I can smell the doubt that you well, picks, so I need to I, I would need to see the hag of me. No. I actually have a really I don't. good okay. relationship. I believe you. Okay. But you know what? I have something that couldn't be fabricated. Claw marks in a wall. I I could make this right now. Really? Just put, find me a wall. Thanks. I've just been, you know, an. Okay, I keep it going. I have to ever did reach out. Prank Anton. Who even are you? It's probably just some. T I would love to tell experience of my life. Oh. Call it really. Okay, it looks human. Is that a tattoo? I don't think so. Or maybe a really bad one. Is that the bear? What is that? Is it? Apparently caused all this. Okay, do we have the actual thing to touch, so to speak? Fortunately, the person who sent this to me was smart enough to know that it would that you, Anton, would investigation. Okay, let's see what happens at the end. Why aren't they coming out with all this? Kids are always on the internet. Th these kids actually have something interesting to say. Why aren't they telling anyone? I don't know. But someone did come out with it. Whoever gathered all this info and submitted it to me. Right. Do we know who this is? This could just be a teenager making fun of you. No. A mm. teenager couldn't possibly do this. I think you're being cyberbullied. This is careful. I think you're being cyberbullied. Information. Someone went into the depths of a dark mystery and retrieved all this information and gave it to me. Someone smart. Someone clever. Someone genius. And it's all been hushed. And if what we're looking at has any truth to it, then I'm not surprised. I think we've been contacted to expose it. So these kids who survived this, they're just out there living their lives? This is interesting. That's, that seems weird to me. I wonder what it took to keep them quiet. Whatever really happened, they'll be carrying it like a curse wherever they go. So you really still don't know who sent this to you? Nope. Complete anonymity. But... The photos, the way they're all set out, it looks like evidence. Like they came from somewhere, I don't know, official. You think the government tried to, uh... Why? Why didn't you tell me about this before? What? Uh, I've been telling you about this it. This is actual stuff, Grace. We have to take this to the police. Okay. So, then you believe I it. don't know. Maybe. You never believe anything. Why is this any different? Because it's starting to make sense, okay? Our name on that letter, the missing hikers, the family secrets. I, when you put it all together, it's certainly something. Mm. He's trying to tell us something. And we should probably stop recording this right now and tell the authorities, right? Heck no, it's just getting juicy. And who says we're not the authorities? Uh, I do. We're not the authorities. What? It's not like we have a moral duty to take this evidence to the authorities. We, we do. Teens acquitted. New evidence reopens Hackett's query qu qu uh, case. New evidence brought forward by podcasting duos meant all charges. 
Bro, I want to see what it said. Okay. Teens acquitted. New evidence reopens Hackett's quarry case. New evidence brought forward by a podcasting duo meant all charges were dropped against teens arrested for the murder of the Hackett family. It is now thought that the deaths were caused by some kind of unidentifiable animal. Interesting. Oh, Travis was going to send them a cease and desist letter to stop talking about how it gets worried. Oh. Best ending quarry. Sounds as true. There's no. Wait, what did bro? This little thing covered it. Oh, see? Unidentified animals loose in North Kill Forest. New evidence in the Hackett's Quarry mystery shows that events may have been triggered by the appearance of dangerous, unidentifiable animals in the forest. Uh, That's scary. This is the true ending? Wait. Just, I just want to see it. Did. That's fine. Does he, like... Down the middle of the road. I just want to see. So, they dodge, and then do they go for the gun, or do they go for the wheel? I don't think it matters. This is movie mode. Oh. Another oh, grab gun. My sources tell me this I mean, is look. a con. Yeah, this is unidentified animal. But did this guy like? Just hack it dead. Oh, oh, boy. oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, this is kind of like our ending. A little different. Where was that guy that I saw, guys? Do you remember? What is that guy's name? Give me a sec. Uh, oh, this guy right here. Okay. There are hundreds of different endings you can explore in the game. Okay, so this is a guy who, like... Got everyone to like live and stuff. I can't tell. Yeah. Okay. Food sometimes. Don't feel too bad for them though. They're nasty. Bandage like this anyways. Huh. Yeah, that's a good point. Weird little. Oh, wait, they have footage of it? Wait, I just want to see this. Things like this, and you're always overselling it. You always have to oversell something to even sell it. That's capitalism, baby. All right. Okay. This is actual footage from one of the oh. trail cams in Hackett Woods. Oh, cool. A camera in the middle of the woods. Did they find a squirrel? Be honest. If it was mounted on a mountain bike, you would watch that whole video. Yes, of course. Is there a mountain bike involved? No, but take a look anyways. Okay. That is a bear? That is a bear to you? There is no way that is a bear. Okay, well, it uh, a skinny bear? Okay, this could be some of the clearest footage of something like this I've ever seen. So they see like kind of blurry though. Blurry and convincing. They see like a werewolf. But the photos, the way they're all set out, it looks like evidence. Like they came from Okay. Thank you, this is actual stuff, Grace. No, maybe. Okay, so what is what is this? Oh yeah. Oh, look. Teens acquitted. Evidence proves shooting was self-defense. The group of summer camp teens charged with murder were released today after new evidence brought to light by a podcast duo show that the death of Kaylee Hackett was accidental caused by self-defense. Oh. oh, and then if you back out, it says what your ending was. So wait, does it do that? Do you have to wait for it to like go all the way through? Yo, Mitchell Zamet from Australia. Thank you for the love, man. He's been here since the GTA days. I appreciate you, brother. And we have Sam Edwards with 15. Always tune in. Subscribe for nine years. Uh, hello to both of you, and I hope you're having a great night. Big fan. I always use your code. Awesome game, by the way. Thank you, Sam. Big shout out to you for the 15, and thank you for your support, brother. I appreciate you. And then we have Ultimate Ollie. Thank you for the seven months. I'm doing good. How are you, brother? Um, Let's see. I think we could probably just back out here. Main menu. And then will it show the ending on the screen? Oh, it doesn't. You might have to like wait. Wait, 
If I load the save, what happens? Psycho teens charge. Okay, yeah, yeah, you know what? After summer camp massacre. What do you think of that, Anton? Psycho teens, one of my favorite punk bands. Okay, so I actually have a really hard time knowing if you're being sarcastic or not. <laughs> okay, well, you know what? That was fun, guys. I really appreciate you all coming through the stream. Um, big shout out to you all. Thank you for the love and support. Um, shout out to 2K for sponsoring the stream. And uh, hit that like button if you guys enjoyed the walkthrough. Uh, make sure to subscribe with the bell for more daily awesome videos. And uh, yeah, big shout out to 2K for sponsoring. If you guys want to check out the quarry, there is like 170 plus endings I've heard from people. So click the link in the description below, download the game, or you can just check out more information by clicking the link and uh, let me know what you guys think. And if you guys get the game, if you guys play it out, um, send me a tweet and I want to know which ending you got. Send me like a screenshot of your like final uh, screen, like the one with the computer here. So uh, yeah, go look up more endings. Go look up all that if you guys want. But I definitely recommend playing it yourself um, and just choosing every choice, you know, whether good or bad. Let the story be shaped by your opinions, and that's the best way to do it. And um, coming soon, apparently, um, let me find it real quick. Um, so a new multiplayer mode for the quarry called Wolfpack will launch on July 8th, where you and up to seven friends or invited players watch along and vote on key decisions, creating a story shaped by the whole group, which is sweet because you and your friends can make a story together, which is very interesting. Um, and then again, this is a new all all new uh, teen horror game where every choice, big or small, shapes your story and determines who t uh, lives to tell a tale. It also has an incredible Hollywood cast. This is by 2K and Supermassive Games, the creators of Until Dawn. And uh, it's available, the quarry is available on PS5, PS4, Xbox Series XS, Xbox One, and Windows PC via Steam. So click the link in the description below and um, take you where you can buy, as guys can buy the game. So again, big shout out to uh, 2K for sponsoring this. Check out the link in the description below. And I will see you guys in the next video. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Hope you had an awesome day. And peace out. We did it. And you know we got the ending before. I mean, we did the stream before. I mentioned it at the start. But we got it where we saved everyone. And it was cool. But we wanted to go back and do it where you know, Abby got taken out because that's our story. That's our story. And, and things ended up being a bit differently. So you love to see it. Thank you guys all. I appreciate it. Super early stream, super late stream. It's 4 a.m. Now I'm going to head to bed. All right. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Hope you had an awesome day and peace out.